Hey guys, um, this is an update on my kernel settings for the LG G3. Um, sorry about the last video not about this not having any audio. It had sensitive audio. Basically, it would be copywritten, and I wouldn't have been able to make any money off of the video, as in I couldn't have made ads. And also, the audio probably would have been cut off anyway. So, what I have done so far is I've lowered the voltages to an extreme low. Let me actually back this thing up. There. That's better. Come on, you piece of shit. There we go. To an extreme low. This is. I'm still testing it, so yeah. Here, and I'm going to show you the time it's been on. This is the uh, total state time. So this is with a set CPU. I haven't had any reboot. I haven't had any crashes. I haven't had any issues to the point that I've had to uh, up to uh, flash the night a new nightly or reboot my phone. Like for example, like some kind of some some something not working and I have having to reboot to fix it because it does happen occasionally with my phone or with any phone on or any com any any device because yeah but me sh let me show you how long it has been on how long it has been on for there you go 2 hours f n 2 out 2 days 4 hours 24 minutes and 56 seconds Okay, and there's the CPU activity. Yes, it does do that a lot. It goes to 2.5 as the max target speed, and the point of that is to keep temperatures down and battery life high, but it does still go to uh, 2.8. And then if you go and look at the temperatures, pretty cold. Um, let's go to set CPU. Crap. You can see the voltage and empery, if that's how you pronounce it. We can see how much battery or how much power is being drained, and also it is at 32% battery. Okay, you can see. That's a huge improvement. In idle, it goes down to 20. So that is like, uh, it no, it doesn't go down to 20. No, I mean what I mean what I mean by idle is basically it sitting on my desk, bedside table, bed, wherever, doing nothing. So yeah, um, let me show you the battery. Okay, there you go. There's the battery meter screen 2 hours 17 minutes but within those 2 hours or 17 minutes of having the screen on I've done things like listen to music um, taking photos videos surfing the web um, um, what else you know <clears throat> you know just basic stuff that you would normally do on your phone and you can still see it says 19 hours left of battery time and you can also see some of the applications that I spent a good amount of time in. Like Snapchat, Instagram, Inbox, Google Plus, and Google Play Music. And I don't know why Google App was there, but yeah. Um, it's still maintaining really good performance. So... It still maintains really good performance. So, and I'll show you a benchmark that I recently got. Here's a recent benchmark. A little low in the uh, multi-core, but pretty damn high in the single core. The single core actually got higher than I expected, but the single core is still pretty damn high for being a Snapdragon 801. 
Um, also, uh, I've also, in this next version, I will be releasing, uh, I will have, it'll have a crap ton of improvements to the graphics governor system. So, in, so I've actually started using Adreno Idler, and I've, I've raised and improved everything that's in here. Um, I think I did some stuff to the hot plug. Um, I don't think I did, but you can see some of the voltages right there. The lowest one is 720. I know people have gotten it down to 700, but I'm still easing down, so this one will be released as a experimental build, because it may not be stable for everyone. So, yeah. But here are the governor settings, so I'm not going to hold it very far, very long, but you can see they are, I'll, I've improved a lot of stuff, and also you can see it does go to 2.8 occasionally, but it tries to stay in the lower clock speeds, even though it can still maintain really good performance in those low clock speeds. But it does boost to 2.7 and 2.8 when needed. So, so yeah, let me go into here. I'll show you some. So, let me turn down the volume. So, let me close that. It's still running in the background, but I'm going to show you how f fast it loads up. So, and you still can maintain a good amount of performance. So, yeah, I, I actually removed um, uh, Google Plus from the cache, and this is how fast it loads. So, so yeah, that that. that doesn't prove anything, then I don't know what does. Um, uh, let's open up Twitter. I'm playing music to show you that it can do multitasking while doing both things. So, and also, so yeah. Good amount of improvements with this build. Um, I'm still going to be improving. And also, Happy New Year's to y'all that are even following this project. So, I'm actually thinking about naming the project something. And it's not even hot. I'm thinking about um, calling it... So I'm thinking about just calling the calling it a, a project. Like, uh, how Nebula current... Uh, the guy who makes Nebula Kernel, I don't even know how to pronounce his username, but I'm going to think about like how he calls his kernel the Nebula Kernel. I'm thinking about calling my cert kernel setting something, but at the same time, I don't want to ma make it look like, oh, this is an entire kernel kind of thing, when it isn't. Or I'm a high-end developer like he is, and yeah, I'm not. I know how to develop stuff. But not from scratch. I usually just do it from. from I usually just like to. I just enjoy modifying other people's code. Like after I learn their their code, I like to go in like video games, for example, and go and mod the shit out of their stuff and either make it better or make it worse and then fix it and improve on it. So and that's kind of like what I'm doing now. I'm improving what the, what uh I'm using the tool, which is the kernel, the and the applications to improve the LG G3 even farther and making it superior than it already is. So, yeah. Um, this video will probably go up um, on uh, yeah, January 2nd. Um, it is 3.46 in the morning where I live. Uh, yeah. So, and if you can't tell from my accent, I live in Georgia. 
Which my accent's not that my southern accent isn't that strong, but I hey what's up y'all? Like that's kinda southern and burning up. Like I don't know. Just wanted to give y'all an update about the stuff. Um about the pro the kernel settings for anyone and that really gives a rat's ass. So yeah. Just subscribe to the channel if you just want more random videos, like the vi hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Also, hit me some likes, give me some likes on uh, XDA if you enjoy my work. So, and comment down below in, in the thread and in the video. Just questions or whatever. And also, please, whoever is using my stuff, please, if you have any questions or if you're having any issues, please comment down below your issues that you're having so I can help you fix them because yeah I am tired of people say, like I had a poll on my thing that I actually got removed because I asked for it to be removed but I but people were saying oh it's crashing it doesn't work well you should ask me to help you fix it because there was one guy that was actually that I was talking to on my thread and and uh, he was saying he was having issues, and I told him something that would that actually easily fixed his stuff. So, yeah, that's how that's how a thread's supposed to work. You put your issues, or you're asking, you ask a question, and I answer back. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, and uh, happy New Year's, y'all, or anyone that really gives a shit. So.